Alice has an urgent issue with neat widgets. People tend to take the path of least resistance, so she shoots an email to the person she most recently interacted with, her sales rep Bob. Bob, recognizing this as a technical problem, wants to get it in the hands of a support agent, so he forwards the request to support at neatwidgets.com. With Salesforce out of the box, a case is created, but the case contact is set to Bob. This means the auto response is sent to him rather than Alice, and Alice is left wondering if her inquiry was even received. Carlos, the support agent, is attempting to work through Alice's case, but first he needs to do some housekeeping. He has to manually change the case contact from Bob to Alice and associate the case with the correct account record in Salesforce. Meanwhile, the clock is ticking and Alice is hearing radio silence and getting frustrated by the slow response time on her urgent issue. You can see how easily simple support request forwarding can snowball and create a negative customer experience, as well as frustration for support agents trying to meet response time goals. With the forward to case feature of email to case premium, if a customer directly contacts an employee at their individual work email, the employee can quickly forward the email to a support email address and a new case is created as if the customer created it. It will be associated with the correct account record so auto response rules and any service entitlements or SLAs will be respected. Forward to case makes it easy for your customers to receive support quickly by removing friction from your case management process. Start a free trial of Email to Case Premium on the App Exchange or visit vicasso.com slash email to case premium to learn more.